Hey everyone, this is Robert Mack with Irvine Real Estate Link, your link to the information that you need to make the right decisions. And today is Monday and it's time for your luxury Monday market update. So I want to talk to you about what's going on right now with the homes in Irvine, what's selling, what's in backup offer status, what's pending, what's gone into escrow, what's sold, how many new listings are there, and all that kind of information, all for homes that are priced in the $2 million price range and above. So, how many listings are currently available in Irvine priced at $2 million and above? And the number is 43, which is actually two more than two weeks ago. So, steadily the inventory is going up. Back in March there was 37, now we're at 43. So, obviously inventory is growing and uh, summer is coming, interest rates are still great. So, sellers are listing their properties because they're looking for the right buyers. Now. Of all the homes available in this price range, there's homes as small as two bed, three bath with 3,025 square feet, all the way up to nine bed, 11 bath with 15,000 square feet. Price ranges range between 2,050,000 and 18,950,000. Of all the sales, of all the homes that are available for sale, out of the 43, three of them are short sales, which take up a very small uh, portion of the market share, and the remaining 40 are standard equity sales. So you're dealing with a real life seller where if, where if you were to submit an offer, you'd get an answer within two to three days. So that's great news for our luxury buyers. At this point, there are still no foreclosures in the $2 million price range and above. So how many new listings have been listed in the last two weeks? Well, a total of five new homes have been put on the market in the last two weeks. Priced as low as $2,554,000 and as high as $3,895,000. So if you're looking in that price range, uh, there are some great new listings available. So you know, contact me for that information. In the last two weeks, three homes have been taken off the market. Two were canceled and one expired. Now the one that expired, expired after 181 days. So they couldn't get an offer and the seller decided that just right now wasn't the time to sell. Of the two that were canceled, one was canceled after only 44 days and the other one canceled after 778 days. A total of eight homes are currently in backup offer or pending status, which means that they're in escrow. Now, last, last time I did the, the Monday market update for the luxury report, there was one home that was in pending status and eight that were in backup offer status. Well, today, there are four in pending and four in backup offer status, which is great news, which means things are moving forward slowly. Typically, when you open escrow, you know, the seller is looking for backup offers just in case the current escrow falls out or doesn't work out. However, after a certain amount of inspections and things like that, the buyers will remove their contingencies, which ultimately take the listing from backup offer status to pending status. So three of the homes that were in backup offer status have gone to the next level of pending. So in the, in the weeks to come, we're going to see these homes selling and closing, uh, which is going to be great news for the luxury market. In the last two weeks, only one home is sold. That home was a six bedroom, seven bath home with 5,220 square feet, sold at $2,995,000. So the average days on the market and the average selling price versus list price and the average square foot price is all going to be based off of this one home. So this home sold in 318 days, which is which is right around the ballpark, um, a little bit more than the average. The average last week was about 200 days. It sold at 92% of its original list price. I'm sorry, 92% of its list price, and it sold at 89% of its original list price. So it came down once, and that was enough for a buyer to submit an offer, and they accepted it at a price of 92% of their list price. And this home sold at $526 per square foot. So I hope that was helpful. Please be sure to leave comments or share this video with anyone you think may benefit from watching it. And don't forget to check out our website, IrvineRealEstateLink.com, for so many great buyers and sellers tips. And I'll talk to you soon.